What's going on guys? Bobby with Consumer Time Capsule back with another review for you here. And at long last, we are back at the Disco Burger King. <laughs> Shout out to David Malinowski for that uh, great nickname. We are here because they just came out with the Cheesy Bacon Crispy Chicken Sandwich. And what we have here is a potato bun. And inside, you have got warm cheese sauce, three strips of smoky bacon. You've got at least one and possibly two slices of American cheese. It's tough to tell. Everything's kind of melting into itself. Like, it but there's def definitely at least one slice of American cheese. You can kind of see that, right, Ryan? And then you got more cheese sauce on the bottom. So two layers of warm cheese sauce, and it's very warm. Uh, and of course, somewhere in here, there's a chicken patty. <laughs> so this is the original chicken sandwich. It does also come, uh, I mean, basically, you can use the spicy filet or the regular filet. We got it just like it shows on the regular menu, but Man, this is a cheese lover's dream. Now, uh, you guys may have noticed recently they also had a Philly Cheese King that also implemented the warm cheese sauce. And we actually never reviewed it. So tomorrow on the CTC review, even though it's now off the menu, we're going to review it anyway. Because apparently still available as a secret menu item while the warm cheese sauce is still available here. So... Let's give this thing a shot. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's so cheesy. <laughs> I love... Mm. Oh, man. It is so cheesy. Well... You know what's funny? I've said this before. You throw Burger King's bacon on a sandwich, it's gonna be the star of the show. Like, they make the best of bacon. Super smoky. And man, is it cheesy. If you like, yeah, maybe. If you like cheese, you will like it. And if you don't, you're just have a healthy fear of it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of additive effect. You know what, you know what though? The American cheese slice is not adding its own flavor. Really, all that's coming from the dual layer cheese, warm cheese sauce. So, pretty good though. Obviously the white meat chicken filet here, um, always solid, always a good pick. Mm. Potato bun is nice. Always like to see that. Again, use on a chicken sandwich here. Ryan? Oh, yeah. Do your, do your best to not smother all this cheese on the camera. Mm. Man, because it is very, very cheesy. So one of these runs, I believe it's $5.49. It is definitely for a limited time. So make sure that, uh, that if you're really big on cheese, or if you like the Philly Cheese King, then, oh, man, we're even going to have a bonus thing. You are the man! Derek, you are the best, man! We even have a bonus. So, on the next review, we're also going to have the peppermint Oreo shake. So, oh, yeah. I totally forgot about that. You are you are the man. Good lord. We, we have it almost too good at Burger King. This is why it's our favorite place to film. Anyway, guys. I, <laughs> basically... I can tell you a million times that if you like cheese, you're going to love it, and if you don't like cheese, you're not, but till we put a grade on it, who knows what you should do, right? So where do we go? <laughs> tell me what to where do. Where do about. we go? What do we do? I got to tell you, I think it might be a little bit too cheesy. I would like maybe, maybe one layer of the warm cheese sauce instead of two. Because it does kind of overpower the delicious chicken sandwich components. Like, you still taste the bacon, 
but maybe not so much the chicken. Ryan, what do you think? I could barely taste it. The chicken just makes it a meaty sandwich. It makes it a meaty sandwich, but makes I, it a more substantial offering. Tastes good, if but... If it had been spicy... Maybe yeah, maybe it would punch through. So, you know, maybe you guys should go a different route than we went, um, because the spicy, yeah, would, would add a little bit more flavor. I mean, you're already pushing like 2,000 milligrams of sodium just with the regular one because it's so much cheese sauce. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Um, but anyway, still pretty solid. I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it, a, I'll give it a six out of 10. I'll give it a six out of 10 in terms of the taste. And I feel like less might be more in this, in this particular, in this particular situation. Now the gimmick, look, you're just throwing cheese on top of cheese on top of cheese. I... Uh, you're figuring out a way to take an existing menu item and make it a little bit more interesting. And, uh, you know, we love stuff like that, so I'm going to give the gimmick a 7 out of 10. So fares a little bit better in the gimmick category than the taste category on this one. But I can't wait to be back tomorrow with the next CTC review because we have got two things to talk about. We've got the... Peppermint Oreo milkshake. Oh, yeah. And look at, I mean, look at this thing. Having we have got the now technically off menu Philly Cheese King. So come back and see us tomorrow for that. And until then, of course, I'll miss until I see you.